Hi, welcome to IBC. Um, my name is Ikuyo Yamada from Capella Systems. I am here with our partner Extreme. So today I'm really excited to be showing the latest of Cambria FT Sync Cluster version 5.0 we just um, released, as well as Cambria Live Series version 5.0. Um, we, I am here to just show you some of the new features that we will be presenting. Um, first off is Cambria FTC. As you can see here, um, this is our UI for Cambria Cluster Manager, which manages multiple Cambria FTC machines for high volume transcoding. Cambria Cluster is able to do job load balancing distributions, um, sending jobs to multiple Cambria FTC to do simultaneous transcoding. A couple new features that I like to just go ahead and go over. Um, one is Cambria Hybrid Load Balancing. So basically you could have a Cambria cluster and multiple Cambria FTCs on promise. And when it reaches certain peak capacity, it's able to queue off the jobs into the cloud. So when you have a high volume transcoding for specific months or weeks, you don't necessarily have to keep adding multiple machines. Instead, you can kick off jobs into the cloud. Um, right now we support AWS, so you could enter your AWS credential information. Uh, Cambria Cluster is able to see the machines that are running in AWS and to be able to do the job distributions over to the cloud. Um, another thing that we recently add um, is for uh, web UI. It allows multiple users to monitor and control multiple Cambria FTC and cluster machines. Um, remotely. It just gives you more um, ability to to manage uh, Cambria a cluster and FTC uh, much more easily. For the Cambria Live series, uh, we have a lot of new exciting features such as uh, GPU support. Um, it also runs on Linux. Uh, Cambria cluster and FTC also run on Linux. Um, so if you're using uh, cloud machines, uh, it's much more cost-effective way to run a large transcoding um, machines in, on Linux-based machines. Um, for the Cambria Live, for the BCM uh, from BCM, which is a Cambria broadcast manager, we are able to create YouTube events and to be able to stream directly over to YouTube channels. We also have enhanced a much more improved way of handling um, spotty information to do ad insertion for monetizations. So if you'd like to see, come take a look at all these new features and the latest of version 5.0. We are here right behind Extreme's booth um, in Hall 7D29. We would love to meet as many of you guys as possible and show you what's the latest in person. Thank you.